welcome to my youtube channel thank you guys for joining me here today for those of you who don't know who i am my name is happiness Mbata, and to my new subscribers welcome to my channel this is the adulting with happiness channel to my returning subscribers thank you so much for coming back i don't know why i keep pulling you here whether it's the videos or the titles i'm not sure but i am just glad that you guys are here today's video yo it's gonna be an interesting one i just want to chat to you guys about something that is a huge part of adulting and that is making money right we all need to make a little bit of money whether there's covered or there's no covered we still need to keep the ball rolling we still need to carry on making money there are a couple of ways in which you guys can make money online and that's what i'm going to be discussing in today's video we are going to be chatting about five of my favorite ways of making money online those are completely legal those are safe and those can be done by anybody whether you're a student a full-time worker whether you're a freelancer you can do those on your spare time and earn a couple of bucks here and there so i will not be getting into detail on those websites i will put the links to all those websites and the apps that i'm going to be chatting about today in the description box down below and you guys can check them out in your spare time or if you get a little bit too broke you can check those out so without wasting much of your time let's just chat about those different ways and hopefully you guys learn a thing or two okay so the first site that i'm going to be discussing with you guys today is rev.com so what rev.com does is it hires transcribers to transcribe different audios or videos and those audios are maybe audios from meetings audiobooks or anything like that they just need it transcribed and you might just be the person so how it works is that you sign up to their website obviously and they first make you do a test which does take a while it is a bit tricky because on that test they will make you listen to different kinds of audios and you have to try transcribe that audio transcribing meaning that you have to listen to that audio and type down what you think the people are saying that's they check your grammar they check your english they check everything that has to do with english right and for you to actually get the jobs on um, rev.com you actually have to pass that test and when you have passed that test you will get an email that tells you that oh you can now start working on the jobs there and sometimes there are jobs sometimes there are no jobs so you just have to keep your eye on the website and log in and to check if there are any available jobs there are a couple of people that are making money from this website i personally didn't make money from this website this is because i was very busy and sometimes i would forget my password and then that meant that i had to retake the test sometimes i'd fail the test it's completely normal to fail the test it is a hard test so don't be too hard on yourself like the test gets a little bit complicated but i'm going to put the link on the description box below and you can check it out and see if this is the online job for you a okay, second method of making money online is a website or there is a website called rapid workers right same as the other websites i'll put it in the description box below what you do on rapid um, workers is that you sign up and you become one of their rapid workers and what you do as a work rapid worker oh tongue tied so what you do as a rapid worker is that you actually get paid to like videos watch videos like ads like websites visit websites basically is jobs for you to increase clicks for other companies and that's video clicks ad likes ad views and all of that it's pretty much simple but with simplicity comes not so much money because you do not actually get paid a lot to actually do this there is another website called micro workers where they actually pay you like um in dollars on your paypal they pay like 50 cent to watch a video or to click on an ad it's not much but the more you do it the more the money gets um accumulated and the more you have so if this is the website if this is what you think you can do or yeah i'm sure you can do it because it doesn't require a lot but it doesn't pay a lot as well so if you're interested you can check it out okay so method number three so now we're getting to my favorite methods guys i am absolutely in love with those three next methods of making money online and i'm just i just might get into a little bit more detail on these methods because i love them so much so method number three would be selling digital products online right so by digital products i mean your templates i mean your designs i mean calendars i mean wedding invitations whatever you can create online whatever you can design online and you think you can sell it this is just for you so what you do is that you open up an account on canva if you already have one great i use the pro account on canva because there's so much more that you can do with it so once you have an account play around design anything 
budgeting templates, wedding invitations, birthday invitations. And if you think these designs are just awesome, have you ever looked at your design and actually thought, this is just awesome? So if you think your design is awesome, let's sell it. So what you do is you open an account again on Etsy, right? So I will put the website name and the link on the description box below. So Etsy is an American account where, I'm not sure if it's American, I don't wanna say the wrong things. It is a website where you can sell digital products, your templates, your designs, and anything that you can just sell online. Now, digital products work best because you don't need to deliver them. You don't need to pay any fees or anything like that. You just send, when, when someone buys the digital product, they can just download it or you can send it to them via email. So most of the digital products that sell very well on Etsy are your wedding invitations because sometimes people are just too lazy to create their own designs. So they'd rather just download an, a template, right? I would personally download a budgeting template. So I hope that gives you an idea and I hope you get creating that budgeting template because I am looking for one and I'm willing to pay for one. So once you've created your budgeting template, you upload it onto Etsy you and you've created your account as a seller. So you can now upload your products there, your templates. It doesn't matter what you can create you can upload it there making sure that obviously it sticks to the guidelines and it is legal so you can create it upload it there and then start selling it and the fun thing is that you don't have to do anything you just have to wait for someone to click on it download it pay for it actually and then download it and you can still make money whilst you sleep so it is nice <laughs> Okay, so method number four of making money online is absolutely my favorite method of making money online. I still do this till today and I love it. This is online surveys. I know you're probably thinking online surveys are not South African friendly because most of the websites will be like, oh, you need an American bank account, blah, blah, blah. Well, those ones are perfect and they will accommodate you. So all you need to have is just make sure you have a PayPal account and make sure you can withdraw that money from your PayPal account if you want to. Personally, I do not withdraw the money from my PayPal account, PayPal account. So I just keep it there and I continue spending it from PayPal. There are a couple of places in South Africa that still take PayPal or that will start taking PayPal in the next, yeah, in the next couple of years or months. <laughs> so we don't know yet, but yeah. So the few, I'm gonna share, I think four or five websites with you guys where you can fill in online surveys or take part in online surveys to make a couple of bucks. So the first one is Profilic. Profilic is heaven sent, honestly guys. You get paid for doing the best things, right? It doesn't feel like work. It feels like something that you do to unwind after a long day at work, right? It, it is absolutely amazing. So what you do on PayPal is that there are certain things that different things that you do, different activities that you part, take part in, such as, you know, watching a video, answering questions about your job, answering questions about yourself, um, you know, mimicking expressions on a picture, telling them how a picture makes you feel, telling them how the emotions in the, in the audio are portrayed, listening to a song and talking about how it makes you feel. So there are those kind of surveys and they already sound like fun. They are really fun. Trust me with this one, guys. I will add the link on the description box down below. It's called Prophilic. And you get paid through PayPal. You have two days in which you can cash out and that's a Tuesday and a Friday. I know now, like they have changed the way they used to do things. Previously, you used to be able to sign up and then just get started with the surveys now as i hear they have waiting lines or waiting rooms or something like that where they actually put you on a waiting list yes a waiting list and you have to wait for a while and then they can put you in maybe they put you in when someone else deactivates their account or someone hasn't been active there but then they just yeah they actually just add you there and then you can start making money online and then the next one is called Switched On. I think Switched On is South Africans. Most of their questions are about DSTV. So maybe DSTV is sponsoring this one. It can get a little bit hard because some of us don't have DSTV. So you just have to wait for surveys where they're not asking you about DSTV. Um, and they pay you in vouchers. Sometimes they pay you in points, but mostly it's in points that you can later change to vouchers or cash um i have mostly made vouchers or worn vouchers from this website it's called switched on it's the switched on research community and the nice thing is that they send you emails just to tell you there's a new survey and you need to fill it up or if you don't qualify for a survey they you know let you know that you don't qualify and try to find other surveys for you it's called switched on 
research community okay and then the next one is my voice so my voice and your view are kind of similar i don't know the difference because they all do pain points and i haven't really made much money from those ones but i find them very accommodating for people who have time i haven't made money from the sites because i really do not have the time but i have made money from profilic another tip when it comes to profilic is keep it open on your desktop make sure you have a laptop for this one because sometimes they don't notify you when there are new surveys so when you keep the page open it refreshes on its own and your laptop does that whole thing thing to let you know that there's a survey and you have the quickest fingers first you have to have quick fingers as soon as you hear that thing rush to your laptop click on participate and make a couple of bucks Okay, so the past four methods that I've mentioned, are actually, they don't, they don't actually give you enough money to depend on them, right? To actually think of it as your way of living or your way of survival, right? Cool, you can make a thousand rand, five hundred rand there, here and there, but is it enough to sustain you? I don't think it is. Personally, I really do not think it is. Some people might think, yes, it is, it, like, it is okay to sustain me. I can budget from this money. So depending on the time that you have, you can fill out surveys um i don't want to say for a living because it's really not it's really not worth it at times but as a student to make extra money you can actually do this but the fifth and the last method of making money online that i think will give you enough money to sustain you will give you enough money to actually make a living out of this is freelancing guys a lot of people are quitting their jobs they're quitting their full-time jobs to actually go freelancing full-time right because that's how much money you make from freelancing with freelancing you're able to decide how much you want to work how much you want to make how much you want to actually do anything it's all up to you you're the entrepreneur right you can also freelance whilst you're working a full-time job i tried doing that for a while but it got a little bit draining at the end so you can do that but I mean, why am I saying but? You actually do make a lot of money. You can make more than 5,000 rand a month. You can make more than 10,000 rand a month from freelancing, depending on the kind of freelancing that you're doing, right? So there are a couple of apps or a couple of websites that I personally use for my freelancing or that I used to use for my freelancing and I'll still go back to use for my freelancing, right? So the first um, one that I want to share with you guys is Upwork. Upwork is American, so you can actually get hired by people from america people from dubai people from you know angola people from anywhere in the world to actually do marketing jobs for them right so with upwork i've seen that it's mostly marketing or maybe because i'm in marketing that's why i've seen marketing but if you're a software engineer marketing graphic designer and all of the above you can register on upwork and get hired by people overseas the nice thing is that you get paid in dollars so the rate kind of works in your favor sometimes and you can actually track your time on upwork it does everything for you it makes everything secure meaning that your um your employer cannot just say they're not paying you right so upwork in a way kind of holds on to the money and once you're done with the job then the employer can like release the money for it to be paid to you or if you complain to upwork and say that this person did not pay, pay you upwork has processes and procedures that it follows to ensure that such cases are resolved but it is completely safe it is reliable and it's just the best then the other website is fiverr i haven't really used fiverr but i've seen their ads a lot i'm guessing that it works kind of like upwork you guys can check it out and see if it is really your thing it wasn't my thing so i can't really say much about it and then one of the best ones which i think it is very friendly for south africans and it is amazing is a south african group called the resource yeah, the resource it's just called the resource i don't want to say the resource group and then you go and check for the resource group it's called the resource you find this group on facebook now how it works on this group is that you have employers posting jobs every second i am not exaggerating by saying every second they literally post jobs every second of the day whether it's marketing jobs software engineers graphic designers website builders every time they are posting jobs right so i could log on right now and then the next minute i see 16 new posts and these are possible jobs these are jobs that you can um, apply to these are jobs that you can get these are jobs that you can arrange meetings for these are jobs that you can you know just chat to the person because most of the people that actually post jobs in those groups or in that group are south africans mostly from cape town johannesburg and durban so please do give it a try and see if this is something that you like 
and yeah let me know how it goes for you oh i actually just spoke a lot but that's okay i mean i was teaching you guys something this is adulting we teach each other right so if you guys have any questions about anything that i said in this video or if you would like me to dive deeper into a topic then please do let me know in the comment section down below i absolutely love giving the love back to you guys so i will try to respond to as many comments as i can or as many responses as i can i try to just like or to respond if i can thank you so much for all the love that you guys have been showing on my previous videos i am most grateful please feel free to subscribe to like to share with all your friends and to follow me on social media i will leave my social media handles on the description and they will pop up in the screen somewhere here as soon as i'm done talking so without me wasting much of your time thank you so much guys i love you all so much thank you Mwah. bye